welcome back to Life and Beauty with Sarah. Today I'm going to do the April Ipsy Glam Bag. I just got this in the mail yesterday and I'm super excited to see what's inside. I know that this month's theme was Bohemian, I think in the spirit of Coachella, which also happened this month. So let's see what I got. So the first thing I noticed that's different about this bag is that this month's bag seems to be made out of hemp, like a natural fiber feeling to it, sort of like a um, tote bag that you would get that's made out of like, you know, those those bags that are made out of sacks, I guess. Um, usually I feel like the Ipsy Glam bags are made out of this much tougher, sort of like plasticky feeling to it, but this feels natural, feels really nice. Um, it also has a stitching in it with different colors, and it's really fun, it's really cool. I like that it's more... Um, neutral than some of the other Ipsy Glam Bags that we've been getting have been really, you know, sparkly or bright, which of course I love. But this I like because it's more neutral, it's more subtle, and I feel like it's something that will stay relevant for a long time. So the first thing that I see in my Ipsy Glam Bag is the Hikari Blush in Tango. I have to say I'm really impressed that this seems like a full-size product. It seems like a very well-sized blush, and I feel like usually the blushes that I've been getting from Ipsy are kind of small, and I use I use blush basically every day because I feel like it you know, wakes up my face. And so it's nice to get a blush that seems like a full size. Um, I was a little bit worried that this blush would be a little bit too pink for me, but I really like that this is a nice coral color. It has sort of like peachy, orangey undertones to it that I feel like are perfect for spring. So I can't wait to try it. The next thing that's in my Ipsy Glam bag, ironically, is something that's super, super tiny. <laughs> this is probably the smallest um, product I've gotten in an Ipsy Glam bag ever. It's so small. It's the Nude Dude Mini Nude Eyeshadow by The Balm and I got it in the shade Flirty. So I believe this is like a mini eyeshadow. Um, as you can see, the packaging is really fun, but the product itself is so tiny, which in a way I guess is good because I can sample it without having to have a lot of it go to waste since I feel like almost every month now I've been getting this sort of tone eyeshadow. I've been getting an eyeshadow that's brown with gold flecks in it, um, sort of on the more neutral palette, which is actually really good because those are the only eyeshadows that I use. But I have been getting a lot of them. Every single month, I think I've been getting one of them. So it's good that this is really small. Another small product that I got in my FC Glam Bag this month is the All Natural Tinted Lip and Cheek Balm by Mulan and Sparrow. I believe this is a cheek and lip tint. Um, it's, as you can see, it has this nice, like, old-fashioned kind of packaging to it, and I like that it comes in a little tin. It looks dark in the pot, but when you put it on, it's actually very sheer. If anything, I wish that it had more pigment to it, um, but I feel like this is nice for the springtime when you add, want to add a little bit of color, but you don't want to go too crazy. And it's really nice because it fits right into any kind of purse you have, even a tiny clutch, this will fit in it. So that makes it nice and handy. And another really small sample size product I got is the Star Looks Lip Gloss in the shade Cuddle, which is a really cute name for a shade. And it's sort of this nude, um, almost like brownish pink with sparkles in it. So this is what the lip gloss looks like when it's on. It actually has a little bit more peachy undertones than I expected, which is good, I like that. And it's sparkly, it's fun, it has a nice um, coconutty sort of cocoa smell to it. It's um, not too sticky, it goes on really easily, and I'm actually surprised by how much I like the formula of this lip gloss. Um, I actually think I'm gonna use this, which is good. <laughs> it's always nice to get things that you know right away that you're gonna use. And lastly, the product that I was most excited for my Ipsy Glam Bag is the Hey Honey Good Morning Honey Silk Facial Serum. And I've been hearing so much about this brand recently, and I saw that a lot of other Ipsters got the Hey Honey, I think it's the, the peeling mask and I was really jealous because I really wanted to try it and it looked really nice and since then I feel like I've been hearing so much about the Hey Honey brand so I can't wait to try um, a morning serum I mean 
I don't have that much stuff that I put on in the morning. I usually keep it really simple. So I feel like this small serum will do wonders, hopefully. <laughs> well guys, that was my April 2015 glam bag. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope all of you are enjoying the spring and the nice weather if you guys are getting it yet. I know we are just starting to get it here in New York. Uh, so have a great week, guys. Bye!